Hello YouTube, it's LTS Crypto. I have got something for you guys. I have been tallying up from some of my gaming, and the gaming is, that's my little tally, uh, from Crypto Dragons, a game by Realist, which I'm playing on my Android phone, my Moto uh, Stylo 5G, Stylus 5G, the 5G whatever it is. And in doing so, I have been debating whether it's better to get, you know, the the membership. There's a silver, there's a gold, uh, there's a platinum. And you look, silver's ten bucks a month, around ten dollars. Then you got your gold; it's worth about forty uh, a month. Well, I say you pay forty a month. And then you got the platinum, which I think is two hundred and twenty something dollars a month. Anyway. So I took the plunge, paid the $10, and for that month, I looked at what we got, which is an additional capsule. And I wanted to just share, because what had happened earlier is before I started keeping up with it, I had hit the jackpot on one, and basically with one capsule paid, technically paid, for my membership. And that's a maybe. That's a that's you know, I'm using quotations with one hand. I, I and I'll show you what I'm talking about in just a minute, which I've got some hopeful news on that. But when you look from what I actually when I started putting the Google Sheets thing on my phone, I hit the thing. I hit the capsule that was the main difference in in the the silver plan and just the normal play is that you got one iron capsule. A day all right for those who've never played it you don't know what I'm talking about but just let me just kind of give you an idea behind the reasoning behind what I was doing because so often we do play these games to actually earn money I don't necessarily um, advise playing games for money but I, you know, it play to earn um, it, it, it's a thing there's um, and so if, if there's a system that works, then we need to probably figure it out, especially if you play games anyway. But I'm trying to keep my mind active, getting older, you know, your brain starts doing this little thing where it gets foggy and it doesn't work as good, kind of like your eyes. You have to start putting on glasses to see because everything's blurry. And it's called getting older. But you need to keep your mind, mind active. So gaming can do that. So Realist is the company that has done this. As you look, um, it says play, collect, earn. Our games, Legends of Listeria. Notice it has zero reviews. And the reason why, I think it's never went up on the server yet. I had actually downloaded it. And upon downloading it, trying to play it, it didn't play so I went to the discord or the telegram I can't remember which one I went to and I said hey I, I, I'm trying to play your game I've tried three times and I said oh the server's not up yet I haven't tried in the last couple of months so it may be up may not be but I mean beautiful game looks like it would be very fun to play and I'm an old Final Fantasy guy you know I, I, I played Final Fantasy uh, 1 I played Final Fantasy seven until my wife hid the, pl the playstation from me that was years ago we had small kids um so you know it kind of thought well that'd be great i love stuff like that uh get in trouble with the wife again um but when you look they've got their own token which is the list token and they've got an nft marketplace and it says some of the objects in our games are nfts each of which has its own value and uniqueness and that's something i want to discuss because that's not, when I think of NFTs, I, I don't necessarily think of NFTs like that they are. And I, I'll explain that in a minute. All right, but first, let's look at the numbers. We go over here, and I started on the second. Actually, I started on the first. No, I started on the first and then forgot to write the number down. Okay. So as soon as I started getting the, the $10 a month silver package, this is the additional capsule and the amount that came out of the capsule, which is supposed to be a random amount, but it was generally 0.704 less. 
token. That's what you got, list token. All right, you see, then sometimes you have a 3.7037. All right, sometimes you have a, uh, a said so there's a 14.814. Like, woo, exciting. All uh, right, um, and you can buy the list token and do things with it. The only thing is, uh, it gives a, a dollar amount for the list. So in your withdrawal, it actually says that each list is worth point, um, uh, let's see, I can tell you real quick. It says, yeah, point 0.135, because that's my formula. Point 0.135, and that's how I did my calculation. And so as I was looking, I was taking that number, adding it down here in the bottom. Throughout the month, I ended up with 67 lists extra and then an estimated dollar amount of $9.99. Now the issue is, can you remove that list and then sell it and have US dollars? That is the question. What has happened with this uh, game is, you know, if you follow them, they're now getting their certification. Uh, they're, you know, CERTIC. We have finished auditing or smart contract. Well, why are they doing that? Okay. Um, when you look on their website, there is how to withdraw lists. Says, oh, exciting. But then it says only testnet lists are available to withdraw for now. And what you find is that it is on the near network. All this is going on with the near network, which is a very hopeful sign. Uh, when you look uh, with the test withdrawal, um, you, you can actually, you know, I, I took and sent 14.5 test lists and it went into my test wallet my test near wallet which I set up and they give you 200 near test near it's not real money but they let you play around with it and that's with this uh, near wallet all right so what does it tell me is that they're getting ready to launch this token on the market now will it remain 0.135 don't know so I, it, it, the market will determine how much this token, it, you know, how, how much it's going to be. And maybe the 0.135 is expectation, to set expectation. I don't know. But as for now, again, if it's worth what they say it's worth and buying it with your own cash from your own pocket now to put it in lists to use in the game that you may or may not be able to take out later, they're placing it at 0.135 cents per list. Yeah, 0.135 dollars. So it's 13.5 cents. Yeah, I'm gonna get it straight in a minute. Anyway, uh, as you're looking though, everything seems to be coming along. I mean, they're not perfect. You know, the, um, there's been some projects, and I'm like, what's happening? Their communication has not been fantastic concerning, um, you know, Legends of Listeria. I haven't. You know, and, and I understand. You you get into a project and it just doesn't work. I understand. Oh, I understand. But I'll tell you, communication is key. You know, communication is another setback. You know, but we're doing this. Another setback, but we're doing this. What is horrible is when you go into hiding. And uh, and, and they haven't done that. They haven't done that. They're still active on Twitter. They're still active on their Discord and, and Telegram. So, um... So it's something I am looking forward to. I have now, uh, as of this date, 1128, I have started the gold subscription. And so far, it's not, it's not, I mean, it's three days in. So we're going to find out. And in the gold subscription, you not only get the gold capsule, but you then get the iron capsule that came with the silver uh, subscription. So theoretically, you'll get all that you would have gotten from the prior tier plus whatever is on top of it, plus whatever you get that's on the free game, which is not a lot. All right, uh, something that I, I also, I have been, I have found in NFT wise, is there is my first legendary NFT that I got. I have never been able to afford a legendary NFT, and I have followed this from the the, basically the, the beginning of the project and everything's been so expensive until now because the market's bottomed out and so here I am trying to scoop up what I wanted when it was just 
you know, going uh, you know, full tilt. But I want to show you something that uh, that may be of interest to those trying to to get something legendary. Uh, of course, I'm not suggesting you get something like this because as soon as you do, it will go to nothing. You know, they'll have their own version of um, whatever FTX had going on, and and you know, they'll end up the, in, in the Bahamas and <clears throat> where's your money at? I, you know. You don't know what these people are going to do, but from what I've seen, they're they've given me every reason to trust them. But I say that to say this: do not take any of my advice to buy anything, because as soon as you do, you will probably lose money. Okay, so take it with a grain of salt. Do your own research. But let me show what I found out. If you go over here to the marketplace. You know, go to Mouse Haunt, not Mouse Hunt, Mouse Haunt, like with ghosts, mousehaunt.com. And there is this Web 3 section right here. And in that Web 3 section, you know, you got some basic on how to start marketplace inventory, stashing, withdraw, and deposit. All right. In the marketplace, they've got a fairly nice um, filter. Uh, you can go in and explore now and basically what they will show you at the trending products is the cheapest legendaries that are mice and right now it is showing that you can get this right here I'll pull it up it says that you can get this fast frontier agus legendary traits brave and stuttered stubborn rank level wood zero and it gives us NFT number Gives a little description of who he is. And then 1900 MF, MHT, Mouse Hunt Token, which doesn't mean much to anybody. But you look over here at this 95 BUSD, which is pegged to a dollar. You know, it's a dollar for one BUSD. And it's saying it's 95. Well, I thought that's still expensive. If you will, since the... The Binance, uh, I guess BNB, has has went down. Well, I haven't checked it today, but it has come down, which would mean that the mouse hunt token generally goes down as well. And I noticed that when I went back shopping, that this number here of the BUSD didn't change. But if you go on the phone my android phone go in there log in with your wallet and go and look and hit on the order details for instance i'm looking at my phone you can't see my phone but on the phone right now it says 82.75 busd 82.75 because it is actually calculating from the mht token value and you can go on deck screener and see what that value is and I just noticed it was going down, but on the website, the main website, it just shows 95 BUSD. And so I went ahead and I bought my first legendary uh, mouse. And uh, it's great. It's great. <laughs> it's just the fastest, most producing um, you know, mouse that loots these things. It's, it's fantastic. It's fantastic. And um, it's cool. And so now maybe the time when you get your legendary not just a mouse haunt but look in other places because everything is so so down now phantom is bumping back up but but bnb stuff bnb ethereum stuff look at it see if you can go in because the value you know that was just this thing when you look across <clears throat> you know talk about the the u.s dollar when it gets weak or when it gets strong uh, you know uh, to the european uh, you know dollar like the german whatever that you can go over there and your dollar will go further. Well, that's what's happening here, is that you are able to go in because the dollar is weak and and go in and buy these things at, a, at a more of a discount, especially if people have put stuff up and have not taken it back down and readjusted the price. So anyway, I'm excited about, I'm excited about this. Um, I'm more so excited about Mouse Haunt than I am about 
Realis. But, I mean, Realis is just a fun game. But if you have any anything that could help us in our, our gaming or maybe fun games for our, you know some of us, I'm not... It's not like I'm getting too old to sit down in front of a console, but I will sit on my lunch break or waiting at Walmart and play a game in my car, you know. And uh, and I've also got the point now where I wake up in the morning and check my mice, make sure they're all awake, and then I check my dragons, and then I go about my day, fix my coffee, whatever. And so, uh, just a way I can like slowly be drawing in these coins, whether they come in or not. So we shall see. Uh, anyway, if you have any questions or comments, put them down below. Uh, I have now five subscribers. You see that? Five subscribers. Slow, steady crime, uh, climb. And you see, at a thousand sub uh, subscribers, I will lose my mind and then monetize, and y'all all hate me. <sighs> y'all couldn't handle me if I started making money at this. Y'all couldn't. I I really couldn't. Oh, here's spilling coffee on myself. Uh, subscribe if you want to. If you think I deserve it, subscribe. Hit the notification and the bell. Then you'll see the next video that comes up. Um, hit the like. You can even hit this like. Don't care. I, I, well, I do care. You know. But anyway, give me a little bit of feedback. Give me a little feedback on this right here. And uh, we'll, we'll do this journey together. I, hopefully, uh, it will not be about gaming next time, but something in the DeFi space. Uh, if you have any suggestions or say, hey, I really would like you to look at this, I will dig into it and look at it. And, of course, my advice is what you pay for it. It's free. It's zero. It's absolutely worth it. And so I will holler at y'all next video. I'm LTS Crypto. Bye.